ITV Racing's back tomorrow afternoon for the final day of glorious Goodwood. Ed and Francesca up here with all the action live from 25 past 1. And more young singers will be hoping to have the coaches spinning in their seats tomorrow night when the auditions continue on The Voice Kids at 25 past 7. Potato. Number 63. You'll never beat me. The Vibra Power Light. Lightweight, versatile, and great for those new to vibration training equipment. Featuring five preset programs, 20 speed levels, plus manual mode 2, the remote controlled Fibre Power Light combined with the exercises targets key muscle groups. Available in a choice of colors and with a handy carry bag and DVD too. Call or log on to idealworld.tv slash life to get your Fibre Power Life for $119.99 plus $5.99 postage. research on pause. We've lost 44 million pounds of funding for research that could save lives. We urgently need your donations to get back on track and make more moments like this. You don't need any further treatment. Right. Please donate now and together we will still be coming. There are two ways to start your day. Choose four layers of fortified whole grain shreddiness. ITV News from Granada Reports with Mel Barham.
Hello and welcome to Granada Reports, live with the latest across the Northwest. On the programme this evening. These are targeted measures on social contact between households, which the data tells us is driving the current increase in cases. The lockdown targeting friends and family, how the government's trying to halt the spread of coronavirus by trying to stop millions of people in our region from socialising. So the whole thing really isn't joined up, and it just leads to an enormous amount of confusion. We'll be trying to clear up some of that confusion as we answer some of the many questions you've been asking about the new measures. Also tonight... Eid Mubarak to all our Muslim viewers, how the Holy Festival has been celebrated with sunshine, safety and social distancing. This is uh, like a breath of fresh air literally because, um, you know, in May people couldn't go to the mosque, people couldn't gather in congregations. One year on, we're back in the village that came close to being washed away after a dam started breaking up. And at last, the Super League season is ready to kick off. First, and it's the new lockdown targeting families and friends in Greater Manchester and parts of East Lancashire, which